again, Stats on Students. Uh, today we are going to look at question four from, well, the second question from your holiday uh, stats questions for homework. And this one is a uh, is dealing with data. We're going, going to draw a stem and leaf diagram and then we're going to work out a lower quartile from this. This is something that we had a little bit of trouble with uh, before the holidays. Um, so hopefully having gone over that earlier video, this one will be a bit easier for you. So we've got these 11 caravans in a showroom, and uh, the, this is the prices of them, 16,800, etc. And we've got to represent them on a stem and leaf diagram. Uh, okay, this is worth three marks. Well, my stem and leaf diagram, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to pop in a little line here. I can see that the lowest one seems to be about, ooh, is it 14,000? Yeah, I think it's 14,300. Um, and... Uh, our highest is uh, 18,500. 18, so um, I'm going to pop in uh, numbers like this. So first one I'm going to go uh, 14. Okay, and that represents 14,000. And then we have uh, 15. And then we'll have 16, 17 and 18. Okay. And then we're just going to go in and pop our numbers in. Okay, so last one here, this one. So I'm going to do it like this. I'll put a little key down here. So key. Excuse the dodgy writing. Uh, so I'll say 14, 3. Uh, maybe we say represents or equals Uh, and this will be, hmm, say, 14,300. So make sure you've got a key in there. Okay, and uh, let's just work through these. Uh, the next lowest one, uh, I think, is this one, 15,300. And the next lowest seems to be 15,400. The next lowest seems to be 15,500. That's all of our 15,000. Uh, let's move on to our 16,000. Hmm, 16,100 will be next. Then uh, 16,400. Hmm, and then we've got two 16,800s by the looks of it. So, a couple of eights in here. And then 17s. We've got a three, 17,300 and 17,700. Chuck those in like so, and then we're just left with our highest. I always like to do a little bit of a check because I stuff things up all of the time. There's 11 caravans. Do I have 11 pieces of data? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Yes, I'm good to go. Okay. Now, uh, I've probably got my three marks there. You probably wanted to have key in there to make sure uh, you got your full marks. So I've got a key. Yes. We're all good. Okay, let's move on. Uh, part two, for part two of this uh, question, we have to work out um, the lower quartile of the prices. So uh, when I'm doing this with a stem and leaf, I first of all want to find my median. There are 11 items of data. So we go 11 divided by two, which is 5.5. So that means our sixth item of data is going to be our median. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Make sure you're going up in order uh, from lowest to highest or back highest to lowest. Make sure you do that. Otherwise, you'll stuff it up. Okay, so we've got our, our uh, median is equal to uh, 16,400. Uh, now, to work out the lower quartile, we ignore that and we're looking at everything from here to here. So you see we've got one, two, three, four, five items of data and our middle one is this one here. So this is going to be our lower quartile. So we would say uh, LQ or lower quartile is equal to, uh, now what does that represent? We want to write that uh, so it's... Uh, well, we're dealing with dollars, I think. Well, prices in dollars, yes. Um, 15,000 uh, 
$400. And that is our lower quartile, and uh, we're done with that question. Alright, take care.